Hello there. You alright? Good. Glad to hear it. Um, yeah, this is One Puncher. Um, I'm just knocking you know, a few videos together just to mess around and uh, see where it goes. And yeah, so I, although I'm called the Swan Puncher, um, I obviously don't advocate uh, violence towards animals of a winged nature or indeed non winged creatures, uh, land based uh, or sea based. Uh, or, or indeed sea-based winged creatures such as flying fish these creatures you know let's just let them get on with it um, that's, <laughs> that's where I stand uh, yeah so anyway Spawn Puncher I'm just looking you know together a few videos wasn't quite sure what game to start with uh, so I picked FTL mainly because I uninstalled it recently and thus lost all my ships so I had a save where I had all the ships unlocked and now I now I do not and this, this saddens me, as I personally really enjoy FTL and the roguelike games in general, but um, I have played this quite considerably, and now, obviously, all that work has, uh, has gone, and I need to reclaim what is rightfully mine, or rather my fleets. So, uh, yeah, I'm just going to give it a go and see if I can reclaim my former glory, or whether I will be utterly destroyed uh, in a roguelike nature, so continually destroyed. Okay, so start on a ship. So the only ship you have at the start of the game. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. Ooh. A bit cheeky. Um, okay, well, I had, must have uh, unlocked those in previous ones, so never mind. Let's ignore the bit where I said I start with no ships. So I'd obviously run through and complete it um, after reinstalling, which is uh, a surprise to me, but never mind. Um, yeah, so I'm going to pick, I'm going to go with the Federation Cruiser as I haven't played it since completing. So uh, let's see where it goes from that. So obviously so you get Human, Mantis, Rock and NG Crew. So I'm going to change that dude's name to Swan Puncher. He seems to like it. Um, and we have this fellow. He is a mantis, so he shall be now known. You know, I need I need a name that sums up his uh, noble species uh, and all their all their achievements throughout the galaxy and their technological wonders. I'm going to call him Claw Bastard. There. So there he goes. He he also oh he shortened it. I see that's what he prefers. We have Debbie Debbie the Rock. I'm going to leave that. And we have the NG called Cadreal. Um, Robot V1. Okay. Right, cool. Well, he's accepted that name. Okay. Cool. So, yeah, only got the Type A layout with the burst laser. I don't tend to do very well as this ship, but I'm going to give it a go and see how horrifically this ends up. Okay, so. Mantis, you can get over there. You on weapons. She mantis can go shield. Okay, cool. So that's nice parrot weapons. Always nice to remember to do that. Okay. Everyone's everyone's there. Everyone's working. Right, okay, excellent. So jumping around. As House of Pain would advise us is a good option. Oh. Uh oh. Got a character. Well, we'll soon see how that goes for him. Hopefully, well for me. Ooh, come on. So, I've still got my artillery beam powering up. Oh, I always have to have. I always have to have missiles. Come on, best laser. Okay, shields out of the way. Focusing on the weapons now. Lucky miss there. Okay, great, that's the weapons offline. So now I can just sit here and wait for their inevitable demise. And artillery beam nearly ready to go. Okay. Okay, got stuff. That's nice. Right. Jump to the next one. 
Oh, great. <laughs> a lovely asteroid field and a lurking pirate. So we'll straight away go for his shields. Well, it has only got one shield, so if I time it through the asteroids, I should be alright. really wasn't a great exchange. I've also ignored the fact I've got a fire on board. Luckily near the doors. Okay, weapons offline. <laughs> this is going so well. Come on, rock man. Come on, you love to you love to repair stuff. You know you do. Okay, our oxygen is now offline. <laughs> our shields are now down. Um, really? Oh, okay, my. I will definitely accept that. That is possibly the best outcome I could have had. Hey, I didn't cheek. Oh, did I not? Oh. Okay. Possibly wasn't the best idea if I, I thought I'd accepted that. <laughs> Get out of there. Okay, you're good. You can go in there. You're healing anyway. Let's get you in there. Come on. Okay, weapons online. Why am I not having weapons online? Okay, shields back on. You guys go in there. You get out of there, repair the guns. I'm actually firing. Okay, you get in there briefly. <laughs> this is not going so well. Okay, I pretty much need to wait for the artillery beam to come up. It's the only thing that's going to keep me alive. Okay. Well, that was... Not good. That was awful. Okay, doors need to be repaired. You need to repair that. Okay, I'm nearly dead. Okay, altogether this has been a fabulous start. Um, still sitting. Why am I still sitting? Okay. Right, let's let's just jump out of this place. Possibly powering up weapons would be a better idea. Um, this has been such an awful start. I'm gonna give it a go. Okay, and we got a tiny bit of stuff. Okay, I'm. I want to upgrade the engine so we've got a bit more dodge chance. Well, if I depower the med bay, then we do have that anyway. Okay, so you can get back in there. You, more weapons. You back in with a fleeting visit to the med bay. To ensure the survival. <laughs> okay, let's get oxygen off. No, no, no one really needs oxygen. It's it's very much overrated. Okay. Right. Okay. Well, after that, <laughs> after that very successful start. Well, there's a stall, which I. How oh, brilliant. I get the feeling this is going to be a very short run. Okay, well I'm doing three bursts. Let's let's go with that. Let's be risky. Good. Okay. Right, that's their weapons temporarily offline. Just we really knock it onto the shield so that we're increasing the damage. And wait for the fire. Might as well open the doors to get out. Um, okay. Probably quicker to get someone to repair that manually, but in case of other solar flares having a low oxygen and the rest of the rooms will, will be helpful. Okay, so my mid bay has been blown up, but hopefully that should be okay. At least I'm away before the next solar flare. Hmm. Okay. I reckon I can take him. <laughs> I get the feeling those might be my last words. Well, let's go with it. Okay, so the... Well, let's close all doors. Get 
wasn't my bravery powered. Okay, shields first give up. Uh, you can. Okay, well, shields are more important at the moment. Okay, shields back on. We're hitting through at their weapons. Not enough to take anything offline yet. Okay, you're doing nothing, so you can at least repair the med bay. Not this one at the moment. Uh, I'm not going to accept their surrender. Let's go in there for the increased dodge chance during. We can fix the med bay after the combat. Should have them. The artillery beam should have them soon. Preferably before they fire. Okay, well it resisted, but I should really. Okay, got them. Okay, so now we have a repairable med bay. Okay, so I'm on red health, low scrap. It's not looking entirely, <laughs> entirely great. I can just about afford to get that up. Maybe increasing that is possibly another way to get um, to get through this. It's been a while, so I can't. Give it a go and see, uh, see how I go. Okay, do we want an extra crew member? Yes, yes we do. Yeah. Okay, I'll go for it. You can only die in the attempt, right? I'm going to temporarily turn my oxygen off to decrease the amount of time it takes for my beam to charge up. My health critical, but I needed that swing and weaponry. Okay, hopefully they've hit that. Ah, the dodger chance is good. Let's get him in on that. Actually, sorry, he's no by. Uh, except their surrender. Okay, now we have a new human crew member, Hasifa. Welcome. His talents include embroidery. Not being funny. Just, well, I think that's one of mine. Okay, you're injured as well. You go back there. You swing around there. Human. How much skill have you gained? Okay, you gained a little bit of skill. Okay, but well, that's the next most important system. You back in the engines. You back to there. Okay, now the oxygen on just in time. Okay, so I'm alive. I might even make it out of this, this sector. I would like to get a bit more scrap before leaving. I'm going to jump here and see where, I, see where that leads me. Uh, let's demand surrender. Um, okay. Now they've got a defensive drone, which doesn't really overly bother me because I'm not firing that sort of weaponry. They've got a missile launcher and a laser. So going for their weapons ahead of the shield, although that will decrease some damage if I can take the missile launcher offline because that's going to be the main difference between between the two and I am very close to death. Okay, neither weapon was taken offline. Okay, so my doors are gone. You can get on that. Okay, well I briefly took the missile launcher offline but my <laughs> health is very low. Artillery beam's about to fire so hopefully Right, missile launcher offline. Even those brief breaks of knocking them offline. In fact, the laser as well offline, so they're a sitting duck at the moment. And I've just taken everything out and taken out the defense drone as well. Nice. Okay, sweet. Okay, so I'm I'm still alive, which is uh, surprising to me. <laughs> I didn't quite expect to be alive this long. After the start, I've uh, given myself by very basic errors. Yeah, it's uh, it's a bit harder recording and talking than I thought it would be, and it is <laughs> it's definitely affecting my level of ability. Is my excuse, and frankly, I'm sticking to that. So uh, possibly better get used to that excuse. In fact, um, okay. So it's still on five health. They got a missile launcher. It's about to. <laughs> okay. Hopefully that's taken my weapons offline, which is exactly what I wanted. So now I'm currently sitting here while he hits me. Okay, right, so the weapon's back online. Only three. Hull health two. 
Beam is nearly online. Okay, that's the, <laughs> my least favourite of their weapon. Well, actually not. I like them. Okay, so we've got them down now. Well, just about, just about. Save, I'm gonna save the cash. Uncharted or pirate? Well, that gives us some green further along. Let's give that a go and see where we end up and whether we end up still alive or horrifically dead. Okay. Oh, there was a store. Excellent. That's a good start. That's what we needed. Okay. Please have. Three shots. Oh, I do like those. Okay, don't have much. Okay, well, I'm gonna spend a little bit. On that. To be honest, that step was just about staying alive. So, <laughs> great. Okay, so we have four. I haven't upgraded my doors yet. Mantis and rock man. You can you can go in there. Okay. So we are currently keeping them in the tail. Pretty soon. We really don't want them to take out door control. Med bay needs to be back online for when I need it. Okay, they're no longer in there, so. Fire in the oxygen room, I could really do without. Um, you go in there because you're good at stomping out fires. They're going for my engine. It's really not what I need. Okay, I'm going to get in there to at least decrease the amount of damage that they've done to him. You get out of there. Okay. You, you as well. Okay, sadly he died. Um, he will be remembered forever. Oh, and... Is that one of mine? No, that's one of theirs. Oh god, I've just, I've just left him out of combat. I could have done with him. Okay. Okay, can you follow him? Okay, right, excellent. You heal, you get the engine back on, you get the piloting back on. Oxygen is also needed. We need to get out of here as soon as possible. Ooh, am I even going to make it? Okay, that fire's going to have to be left on. Oh, no, you can get that. Okay, the engine's back online. You guys can get into there. We can now jump. Let's get out of here. Okay, great. That was superb. Superb. Oh, brilliant. A little, little safe zone. Okay, you can go on weapons. You... Shield, well, shields. Engine, and sadly, uh, Swamp Puncher died. He will be remembered. Um, not by me. But I think Hasifa will remember him slightly. Uh, let's let's attack the pipe. Oh, I could do with this. It's not much scrap. Let's be a hero. Let's at least die with honor. Okay, weapons. I'm gonna have to go weapons again. The missile launcher scares me. Um, let's get rid of that for a little more dodge. And we're all right for oxygen. Let's let's just up that five percent extra dodge. That could be the difference. Okay, their weapons are offline, but we've only hit one area of their ship, so the crew members will quickly be recovering that. Okay. Hopefully we should be able to kill them, the beam will do it. Nice. Okay, great. Oh, excellent, they've patched us up. That was very necessary. 
Um, so I think I can make well, I can make that gap. Is that gap longer than that gap? <laughs> let's risk it. This is either going to be the end of the run. Uh, let's aid them. Power up your weapons and engage the. Sorry if I'm skipping through a lot of the screens. Um, in fact, I'm trying not to do that now. I've suddenly just thought about that. Um, okay, so let's fight the fire the laser beams. But yeah, I'm guessing you know if if you want to read the the screen, feel free to to pause. Oh god. Oh yes, um, oxygen. I should really remember when I turn the oh god, this is gonna be a close run thing, and the med bay's off. Okay, I need more power. That was very much closer than... Okay, well at least that bit's off. Offline. Switching that to the... Hopefully the artillery beam's building up, so we're buying ourselves a little time. They are not able to fire at us, so the engine isn't needed at the moment. Shields are down. Let's go for the enemy piloting to make sure they can't escape. Okay. Right, that was uh, that was a good go, and we've got Liam. He has no surname, but um, I'm sure he's a, a capable crew member. He's going to go in there, ready to replace the next team member who dies unexpectedly. Okay, we need a bit more power because I keep having to. Or I could. Uh... Okay, I'm going to go for. Oh, yeah, the shields. It's not too far away. That'll at least give them a tough one. Either shields. So the options are either saving the shields, so that's so that's 50 for the next upgrade, plus 20, 45. So, okay, so we've got 95 for, for the next one of those. Our next level of shields. Um, we could save and be able to get... And well, in fact, I could afford one extra additional weapon which would serve a dual purpose really um, it would mean that I'd have another slot able to use another weapon if I find one and it would also increase if if they hit my weapons it doesn't mean that my burst laser is instantly inoperable as is currently the case um, so this would mean that I'm able to um, at least take a bit of a hit before I lose functionality so you know, it's a it's a tricky one. Um, or I could just, <laughs> yeah, just save a bit. So I just need, um, well, 70 really to be able to get the next level of artillery beam, which would take it from a 40 second cooldown to a 30 second cooldown, and that could be the difference. And um, it means that in a minute fight, rather than it. You know, firing well in a two-minute fight, it means rather than it firing, because you know, I'd say that's possibly an average fight time, or probably under that. But it means that rather than it uh, firing three times, it's firing four. So you know, that's uh, that's very handy, and especially it means that the long-term gain of getting it down to 20 seconds. Um, yeah, given that it cuts down all shields, uh, cuts through all shields as well, it's it's very powerful. But I think I'm gonna go for I think I'm gonna go for that. It's this ship's advantage. I'm gonna play on it and see where we go. So okay, so I need more power in the first place. So I'm just gonna ramp that up by two, so that I've always got my the systems on that I need. Now let's then get around there. Okay, well, ignore that. We're alright for fuel at the moment anyway. Uh, so it's without life forms. Should we investigate? Yes. Yes, let's... Im oh, great. We found stuff. Excellent. Okay, we're not... Okay, this dude... This dude is fine. Aim for the weapons. We've got a 25% evade chance. We're doing okay. <laughs> we we were doing okay. Oh, dear God. 
Okay, the weapons need to be online. Okay, well the breach is secure in the weapons room. Okay, we've got no shields now as well. This could be it. This could be it. Come on, so we've been hit the weapons. I know I need them. Ooh, lucky I moved on. Okay, great. Um Well, someone needs to rush into the I don't know who's gonna volunteer for this mission. Okay, the fight's over, that's a very good thing. I think I might just have to switch them. Switch them round, see where I get, because the oxygen level is draining across the ship. I don't know if he'll survive that walk. Okay, you back in there. You switch. Your health staying the same. Okay, you get out of there. Okay, oxygen is back online. Okay. Right, so oxygen back online, they're healing up. When you he heals, he will go straight into the shield room. Okay, excellent. As will you, you might as well. And so will you and your when you heal up. I can't risk running him across. Okay. He's now alive enough that he can go into the mid bay. Okay, so back to the engines. You were on the artillery beam, but I'm, a lot of people are focusing on my weapons rather than the artillery beam, so I'm going to send you along here, because the NG can always recover. Okay, and you... along here. Okay, and the shield's on. Okay. Okay, well that wasn't... that wasn't as bad as I initially anticipated. But a lot comes down to whether I can make the jump between those two sectors. Because if I can't, then I think that's the run over. Pretty sure. Okay. Asteroid. Okay. Automated scout. With cloaking. Okay. So that means his weapon's going to be charging up while I'm cloaking. Should have got the extra level of weapons. Okay, well, hopefully, I can hit them. <laughs> okay, well, their cloaking's out, out of operation. They've missed. That was lucky. It's just the size of the missiles. It's, they just look horrific. They're absolutely massive. Okay, the laser should put them down. Okay, the asteroid. All the beam. Okay, excellent. So, <laughs> okay, I can't make that jump. So that was a bad, <laughs> bad call. Right, well, I've got to, got to travel back where I came into the rebel fleet. <laughs> This is definitely the end of this run, but I will uh, carry on fighting regardless. Oh, that was such a bad call. Let's at least get you healed up for the final fight. Okay, let's get you in there so for our shields. We need all three to hit to be able to do one damage to their weapon systems. Luckily, all three have hit twice. The artillery beam is nearly there. Shield's nearly back online. Managed to get all three hitting again. Okay, shield's back online. Right, great. That beam took out. Okay, the weapon's fully offline. We can afford to send someone in to repair the breach. The mid <clears throat> in the mid bay. Might as well send all three in so we're getting as much of an advantage as possible. Okay, get out of there. Okay, now you can get back in and heal. Okay, back in the stations for the bonuses. Your 
healthy enough for the fight. Hopefully I'll be able to hit them soon. Okay. Right, now I need to do that. That again. Oh, this is so many jumps through the... Okay, someone's decided to teleport aboard. Okay, the Mantis out of there. It's cheeky buggers. Okay, so I have no shields. Yes, I do. Great. We just leveled up in piloting. Nice work, Hasifa. Um, you need to get on that. Okay, the artillery beams are not done alright. There. Uh, beams offline. Okay, no, it's not. So they shifted the power in the vehicle. I might be able to make it through this one. Okay, I need to switch back to shooting their weapons too. And getting my guy in here for the additional evade. That's it. That's it. <laughs> well, that was definitely coming for a while. Okay, so in retrospect, going straight through the trip round I took where I misjudged how far I could get, you know, it was either I thought I'd try and maximise the amount of, uh, amount of money I got on the second sector rather than going to sector three underpowered and just getting ripped apart so effectively I just I just saved myself a bit of time uh, <laughs> and that's my excuse and I'm sticking to it anyway cool um, it's been the spawn puncher um, yeah cheers if you watch this um, if you didn't watch it then obviously you didn't hear this so uh, you know <laughs> whatever um, yeah cool and um, thanks for watching uh, like subscribe etc all the usual jazz um, yeah, if not, if there's um, any suggestions about, you know, generally how I'm uh, presenting this. I mean, I kind of skimmed over a lot of the information about this game because it's been out for, for a while, so I didn't feel the need, uh, it was necessary, uh, ideally, to um, describe it m more fully. Um, but yeah, so, you know, if you've got any suggestions or anything that you suggest playing, um, yeah, let me know. Um, anyway, thanks very much, and uh, yeah, thanks. All right, later. Bye.